I'm here with two league legends and raconteurs, the immortal Arthur Beetson and the one and only Tommy Rodonikas. Two gentlemen that played in an era back when sex was safe and rugby league was dangerous. Now we're here to answer them a bunch of questions, ask them about their lives, etc., state of origin, so I'll get straight into it. Boys, where did you first meet and how did you first meet? Well, I think it was actually 1971 or 72 and... 72. Uh, was it 72? And it was in the, it was, uh, it was my first state game for New South Wales. Remember, it was under the old system and, uh, and we used to stay at the, 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 um, the, uh, the Morton Bay Hotel, which you used to manage, Arthur. That's right. Yeah, no, yeah. you owned it. You ended up well, owning well, well, it. I, well, I had the lease there, but yeah, Tom, I was sending out a, I was, uh, sending out a load <laughs> to the Morton Bay, and which you do of a morning, and doing a cryptic crossword. And yeah, you little bludger, you turn and you tipped a bucket of well, I don't know what over me. Yeah, but put him in the right situation, Arthur. He was having a, like sending a load to the Morton Bay, and and I was off, actually opposite Arthur having a shower, and uh, and he walked in as I was showering, and and it was the communal showers and baths in them time, not like they had them in in their in their modern like modern day today. So he's gone in there, and I said, I'll get this bloke because I, I didn't really know him. I just I was introduced to him. So what I did, I ran up and I grabbed a. You know, I still had all the water over me. I ran up and uh, I filled up this waste paper paper bin full of um, uh, water and uh, and I pissed in it too. And any, <laughs> no, I didn't. And anyway, and I put toilet paper in it and that. And I walked over and I went over the top and tipped it over Arthur Beach and I ran back in the shower and he opened up the door and you should have seen the look on his face. Mate, he had toilet oh. paper in his hand. <laughs> oh, it was so funny, Arthur. Well, that's it? the first time I met Tommy and you wouldn't believe it, you know. He's, it, and I thought, well, this bloke's not very bright or he's very, very courageous. <laughs> and we have never ever questions Tommy's courage. But uh, anyway, if you ever come to our gigs, we'll tell you what really happened. <laughs> oh, that's right. Because <laughs> not the end of the story. But that's how we met. And after that, we, we, um, yeah, we've we're been good away, mates. Yeah, and of course, we've been away on a couple of tours together. We're 73? 73, well, 75, 77. Yeah, that's right. And them, so, them yeah. times too, Arthur. We both got the Australian captaincy on the 73 tour. We didn't have it very long. And well, again, that's another story. Yeah, that's If you right, come yeah. and watch our shows. So, yeah, I was uh, actually, I was captain in 77 when, uh, in the interstate game. And a lot of people, you know, probably uh, young people wouldn't realise that I actually played 17 times for New South Wales before I played State of Origin, yes, Tommy. Sir. And, of course, I was captain of the game when we were behind. And you were desperate to get on there on the field. That's right, 77 it was, aren't yeah, it? Yeah, and you did. You got on, you started the feud. That's what sort of yeah, started well, the feud with uh, little well, 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 yeah, well, well I, you know, you started the blue in the scrum and I carried on and I, I grabbed Oliphant and, and pounded him and, uh, and, yeah, and but you cutting wound along. Every, you wound everyone up. Oh, I certainly did. And, uh, yeah. and, and I scored the winning try. So it was wonderful, Arthur, wasn't it? Yeah, you were watch it. You're starting to sound intelligent. <laughs> Oh dear. Now, gents, I hear there's, uh, there's a bit of a bet between the two of you, based around state of origin, and as the first origin captains, obviously it's a fairly serious bet, I would assume, so uh, could you please enlighten us as to what you've got in store for, uh, for each other come the end of Origin 3? Well, I think we're unbeatable, but, uh, you know, I, I, I'm sure it won't be me who's uh, doing the bet, because I'm vowed that what I'll do I'll do a, a rap version of something. Now, if Tommy can sing a song, God, I'm sure I, up, sure I can rap something. Did you, what did you do? Did you sing it? Yeah, I was singing it. Yeah, you know, you can get, a, you can get it on the YouTube and uh, yeah. harden up. And, uh, but the thing is, uh, you, you're going to sing a rap song. Well, I... Uh, 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 you, won't be do, you won't be doing much dancing, <laughs> will you? Look, have a look at you. <laughs> A hey, six point five on the Richter scale. Yeah, yeah, that's right, yeah. <laughs> now, you're going to sing a song for anyway, mate. Well, okay. I will if... if, if if uh, New South Wales beats Queensland, and I won't go, it's going to be 3 0. I, 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 and I've got to say, well, I don't think that you can win for the next three years. That's how confident I am. Yeah, well, I, I know we're going to be hard up against it, but look, look, uh, Arthur, okay, I'll tell you what I'm going to do right if we don't beat you, right? Right, And I think we, we're still, I think we can well, beat you. You don't really think that, time. I do, I do, I do. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to get you and put you in a wheelbarrow. Bigger than me. <laughs> <laughs> Talking about wheelbarrows. 
Another story you can hear uh, on, on our little show about Arthur and the wheelbarrow. But I will put Arthur Beecher in the wheelbarrow and I will wheelbarrow him the full length of the rugby league field at Lang Park at one of the Broncos games. Wow. That's incredible. Well, mate, I'll tell you, it's going to be pretty heavy I'll load. Tell you, I'll tell you what, you only got one testicle. You know, you know how, <laughs> mate, you don't want to get, what do they call that thing? They stretch? <laughs> A hernia. A hernia. Yeah, Always no. a good chance. <laughs>